Right then, into game. Spawning in the top right hand corner, he is Drowse, he is Protoss, and he is Red. And his opponent, spawning in the bottom left hand corner, his name is Rove, and he is the Blue Zerg. Dun dun dun. And he does like eggs. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? <laughs> <laughs> they, they, they are like weird coloured eggs, dude. So, yeah. He likes what, eggs. the cocoons? Yeah, they're like eggs. Look, splat, they go, and there yeah, you go. You got your omelette. You got yeah. your omelette out. There you go. That's like the fastest omelette ever, isn't it? I know, man. I wish I could cook that fast. So, ah, from Jazz Off, and we are going to see Forge Fast expand. Ooh, ooh. Definitely will. First time. Have you noticed we've all seen fast games throughout the entire tournament today? It has been about 10 to 11 minute games. All tournament. Yeah, yeah it's good to see. Most games are over by the 16 minute mark anyway, but yeah, yeah it's really good. Some long games. We've had about. I think the longest for them, like, for the. Semi finals, we had 37 minute games. Oh, do you remember? Yeah, 40, no, wow. 47. It's 47 minutes, remember? They yeah. were just mad games. <laughs> so, we do see. Ralph is, has scouted that. I'm having a bit of a drone fight at the moment. Who's going to win? Oh, man. Rove tapping oh, out. The tapping drone out, you know. Packs out. You got so, the there's a forge. Yeah. So, we are going to. I wonder if he's going to go cannon, then nexus, or nexus, then cannon. I want to go nexus. I would usually go nexus, then into cannon. Yeah, I think that's what he's waiting for. His probe is sitting there, so I guess that is what he's going to go for. Oh, look at this. Wrong. Bomb troll. Stopping the uh, hatchery from going down in the natural. Yeah. So we do see the spawning pool first before hatchery, obviously, because there's drones chasing that off, saying, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Oh, no. Drowns, oh, oh, oh. but no. Uh. So he's still <laughs> slowly waiting. He's just, just sitting there, like reading his newspaper. He's reading his newspaper, catching yeah. up on all the Zerg invasion news. Zerg <laughs> 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 is absolutely brilliant. Zerg is invasion. Ladies and gentlemen, they are sitting here over the other side of the map. Hmm. <laughs> so we do see the uh, pylon has completed. He's going to have a bit of a norm against it. He's got two yeah. Zerglings on the way out. So we are going to see that pylon go down very sh shortly. Oh, we see a gateway before a cannon. Ah, uh, he's going to put the cannon in between the gateway and the nexus. That is a full walled off, so that means they have to run what, through here? the middle line. Literally. If you look on the stream, it'll be there. You just got to wait for the delay to finish. Here. Is it? No, uh, I might be wrong. I'll just go to the there. Well, this no, oh, it's, it's the other side. Ah, it's the other side. There a bit behind it, basically yeah. allowing... I was going to say it was to be it. the other side. I thought it was going to be... Yeah. Right, that pylon does fall, and the uh, hatchery does get... But he has taken... Now. No, he's took the other one. He's took his fourth. Yeah. So... Oh, yeah. Took his fifth, sorry. Well, I don't know. Yeah, it's his fifth. Yeah. Yes. Definitely a different position, because normally people would think... They go for this one. That is a very weird position, because... That is where Drowse will be attacking from. Well, you never know, he might be putting spore quarters up. That is a really good spot for sp spore mm. quarters on the ramp. Very late cybernetics core now, at 5 minute mark, which is actually not late, but still. Double gas going down. Hmm. Is that another cannon? Yeah, he has put a cannon outside yeah, as well. Cannons. So, I was, I was kind of right with the cannon's positions. So, we do see the. Ooh, I see a sneaky probe. Yeah. A sneaky, sneaky probe. Hiding behind the smoke. Yeah, smoke. sneaky sneaky pro. Smoke screen. Dun, 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 dun. So the cybernetics cord now finishing up. Canning also and straight into warp tag. No delay whatsoever. Krona boosting the Zella out. Whereas we do look into the base, we see... What do we see? We see gas, gas, and more gas. Well, one thing I do see about this block off is quite bad because the pylon is still vulnerable. And that is a weak link in the chain of this block off. Yeah, both of them are. Mm. Both of them are, aren't they? I would, oh, like see, I would like to see another. Link ain't going anywhere. Yeah, I would like to see another gateway come in front to block the access to that pylon. So if that pylon gets focus fired, then that's pretty much the gateway and the forge down and the cannon. And they could just walk up straight into the ramp again, the main. Basically, if he concentrates, if he comes in here with roaches, and concentrates them. Nah, on, on the forge, it'll be out of the way of the cannon. Oh, we're going to see high tech here yeah. because he's going quadruple for uh, gas. Yeah. Even though uh, Protoss is gas heavy. 
All right, plus one on the way for Might Drows. Let's have a look in the back of the bases. So we do see uh, oh. four gas taken. Yeah, Rob is heavy roach. I don't know. No, they no, don't I think he's going to drone up. He'll then go into a roach tank. I like to see him go roaches, but we'll see. I don't know. Full gas. That means yeah, yeah high tech. Roach. It'd be tech as well. You definitely go for the double evolution chambers. I would expect. Yeah, do you see one coming down? Are we going to see another? As we do see a dancing uh, sentry. Yeah, you're going to see that every day. Don't. See. It's definitely going to be roach tank though. Yeah. And wow. one, two, five. Ah, oh, that's a lot of so five. Six. Six. Six gateways. Yep. Yeah. Okay, yeah. I like that. Uh, that's going to be good. That's going to be really good. So, the problem is, look, he's took these gas and. Oh, there you go. Now I'm only putting wow. in two gas. Has he put too many in that one? No, no, it's three. three. Wow. Okay. Just look, I know, I looked. I was, like, I was like, like, I gas. looked quite a lot. Yeah. Well, I don't know, with this block off, it's definitely a weird block off, and I st that cannon is too far back for my liking. Yeah. With the roaches, range. Have to, yeah, just pick the on the forge. Up. Yeah, they'll just take out the forge and walk up over. Yeah, won't even get attacked. So, let's look at the Overlord positioning. Quite, yeah, nice Overlord positioning. Yeah, at the far He's one got, to the right. Uh, yeah, I like this a lot because this one to the right, uh, the right is going to see for any drops coming in. He's got any a good position. Play, perhaps. Yeah, he's got the ones on like near his base. That's good to see as well. Droning up quite heavily, the evolution chamber has completed. Right, we've got first roaches out on the field. Forty six drones. Yeah, and we see spines right. now going up. Yep. On the natural. I'd like to see that. That is good to see. Mm. Are we going to see the roach movement speed there? I oh, know he's waiting for the lair attack. Yeah. Go lair first, obviously, but Yeah. These roaches against one still cat? Yeah. They're just gonna walk past him. No, no. <laughs> They're right. like, you know what? Just just go away. Uh, he's like, oh, okay, you know what? I don't like you. Yeah. You're dead. Oh, if he just focuses on the forge, he will see. Look, yeah. no, it's can attack. Now we do have armor level 2. Now he does finally get a warp in. Now, in my eyes, from going um, from bronze to gold, you need army size. You really wow. do. Look at the left side. Concentrate. Uh, yeah, I see it, I see it. Uh, you really need to concentrate on army size. Now we do see the zealot walk in. The problem is, look at this. If it's going to finish up, the spore crawler, he does move. Let, the roach is there. They're not doing anything. Yeah. Now they move. Does get the kill on that. He needs to hold position on them. Thing. Oh my word. This is. Fine quarters are just going to do the work. Going to lose his queen. Yeah. Should not have lost that queen to that. No. Now he needs to come up here and go, well, where did them pylons go? Oh, right. There. Yeah, he's quite good That's sneaky pro, boss. Very sneaky pro. It was. Yeah. Did that got, overlord uh, see where they came from, though? He's going to need to research Blink. Yeah, he's got it researching. Ah, right there. I was looking for the... Um, <laughs> the Where's it gone? I think you're blind. Look, that's a lot of sentries, a lot of stalkers. This is what the correct move is. Yeah. Get yourself an army up. Oh, right now. don't push out. Getting some roaches. He's going to see. Oh, yeah, he was pushing out. He's got quite a big army. He won't bother with that, he'll just bug out. And there we go. Oh no, he's not, he's going down to the 30 he's got no fur. So he actually knows he's ahead. Yeah. He's actually, Rob's actually on 134, 134 supply, rather, to 96. Not 34 links in production with Metapod Speed. Infest Pit now coming down. Fur. Wow! 36 links, and now another 10. And 4 roaches, whoa! Yeah, he's definitely going for some heavy... Look at that, that's a lot of links, man! Waiting for Metabite Speed to. He could do the run by. He probably would get past. Actually, I think he would. Then again, I don't know. I would have a sentry between the, the cybernetic yeah. and that gateway there so I can block it depending on where I need to. If it gets through, I can get block attacked it. Either, yeah. yeah. Let's have a look at the Zerg army. That's a big Zerg he army. He hasn't moved his links up. Metabite Speed no, is getting finished. If you look, they are in between. No, but that's the only part of the force. He's got loads back at base. Ah, oh, single file! No, Rob, don't do it! Rob, no, 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 no. This is a massive mistake. You're going to get bottlenecked. Needs to bug out there right now. Take out yeah. them rocks as a definite. Definitely for a Zerg. Well, for any force, really. Yeah. Terran Zerg. Uh, right now, I feel that... He didn't have Rob, to pull back that fast. Yeah, he didn't need to pull back. But look, 
right there, look at the links, look at the roaches, it's going to be a two-pronged attack, he'll come in from the third, which there is no third, but that's the third position, and he'll attack the rocks. Basically, he'll lead the ones here, that's why it's mainly filled with roaches, but we do see a massive stalker warp in. Problem is, he could have had uh, two free warp at that time. All them links coming in, oh, is he going to get the spread? He needs to take out them rocks, he didn't take out the rocks, he's not moving forward, look at the force fields, oh my word, he is getting surrounded. However, these ones are going to get picked off. He needs to pick down the animals. He's not doing it. He's picking off these... Uh, oh, my word. He's doing well. Concentrating on uh, that one. Now, then, reinforcements for right. now he's going to fall in. There's no more warping. There we go. There's the warping. And where's the actual reinforcements for the Zerkler? There wasn't. He did not reinforce himself. Did take down all the immortals, though. But so, yeah. No. One survived. Look, one survived. Very low health. Oh, yeah. Wow. Got five kills as well. Now we are going to see Drow's pushing out. Why? Because his opponent, he knows his opponent's in trouble. Oh, and uh, they're waypointed. Again. Yeah, again. Waypointing single file units. That is why I say you don't do it. Why? There we go. And this is so easy for uh, Drow's to pick off. But a simple file is, a simple fact is they were all single file. All he has to do is just pick off one by one. He lost two, two units, uh, two stalkers rather to the Zergs to complete an uh, army. So, yeah. So we do see the fourth coming down for Rob now. Now, Rob making that, that little bit of a mistake, but he's got some uh, spines going up. If I can click on it, there we go, spines. Yeah, but they're not going to finish in time. Yeah, this is not going to be good as... What I want to see is this uh, split in half. Yeah, that's it. Concentrated fire, but there he is. He needs to get a force field somewhere in here. I'm not sure this is a smart no, idea. Rob has... Gone down I, I, I was going to say, I didn't think this was a smart idea. Rob has gone down from being in head on supply to be low on, lowest on supply. Yeah. 83 to get second of all, and that warping coming in, yeah. he's going to have to sacrifice this base. I just, I, what I would do is have that queen here ready to transfuse on these... Uh, yeah. Oh no, he's going to lose everything. He needs to get out of the way of the Broodlings though. He needs to pick off what he can, these drones. There we go, good blink, good blink. Losing so many drones. Yep. In the process, and yeah. He's going to go back for the spines, I think. I, w I don't think I would. I'd get another warp in, because he's going to need it. As I see these overlords, uh, let's have a look where they go. No, there's one there. Right, so we've got Lings over here in the fourth. So Lings are going to do a run by, however, it isn't going to make a blind difference, because that many Lings versus two cannons isn't going to work. We do see this whole entire army just sitting around doing nothing. I think he should not give uh, Rob, a player of his calibre, that amount of time to do nothing. Right. Yeah. That's a lot of links yeah, he's got there. Yeah, them links. Let, all he has to do... He gave it away, basically. He ran in, thinking, oh, I'll get that run by. The only problem yeah. is, now he walked in a stalker and a zealot. That zealot will be put on hold position. Right, now we see the army moving out. He's going to move up, and he knows he's in trouble. Look, he's right on the tip of the uh, thing. I want to see him take out the uh, rocks. All them links there. Ha where's his sentries? He needs to take out the roaches, obviously. Right, that's it. Smart movement. Good engagement yeah. position. Great engagement position. Right, all he has to do is get one force field or... It doesn't matter. He's like he's really done well there, didn't he? You he have that, so... Wow. Yeah, he's going to take out the spines. Then concentrate on the roaches, which he is going to do. That many immortals versus that many roaches isn't going to work. Plus all the reinforcements, plus another immortal. Ladies and gentlemen, I do believe we're going to see Rov taken out of the championship. Yeah. GG. GG goes down. Drowse takes the win. I think...